Now, I'm back. Hey, Facebook fam. How are you doing? I hope this is much better. It's just a little uh, news I want to give to you today. And um, um, the first post was like really itchy and sketchy and all that little stuff. But I'm just trying to make it better so you can get a good, a complete understanding of what I was trying to do and say. Because I have a lot to cover. I have a lot to cover. Okay. First of all, like I said... When you, if you don't speak Spanish and you're trying to relate to the Spanish community, if you only have a couple words you need to say, don't, and you better know what you're saying. Because if you don't know what you're saying, and then I think it, it could be offensive to them, to their language, and to their, you know, to, to their race. But check this out. Like I was saying that I was on the campaign trail yesterday. You know, and I was handing out, um, you know, the little pamphlets, the little pamphlets that I do, you know, the applications and the little, and the little pamphlets. So anyway, I was, where they go? Anyway, I was handing them out. Okay. And after that, it happened. So I was walking like from like a hundred and, um, eighth to like, uh, a hundred and third. In Compton Avenue, you know, just grinding and, you know, and just making it so that, you know, I could get everybody, all the, the Watts community, you know, and give them a flyer. So I was sitting up there. I was just walking along, walking along. And then I passed one family. Hola, 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 hola. I guess that's hello. Hola, hola. So I'm hola. But see, the thing with me, I could understand it, but I, my, my, Speaking is few words, few to none, you know, few to words. But I do know what I'm saying. But sometimes I don't know what I'm saying. I'm thinking I'm just trying to talk just to fit in. So let me tell you about what I did. So again, because in the first post, you know, that was kind of sketchy. But this is the clarity of what I just did. Okay, take this out. So I'm going along and then I come across this uh, the store. I said, hi, my name is uh, Patricia Willis, you know, and I'm go I'm going for environmental representative here for the city of Watson. You know, I want you to please take my application and all you have to do is just sign it and, you know, and just send it back and, and that's it. Then all of a sudden, um, the lady was on the phone behind the, the, the you know, the counter. She said, um, we're Jehovah Witnesses and... We don't do that. I said, huh? But to my recollection, I ain't never, ever, 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 ever seen no damn uh, Hispanic Jehovah Witnesses. All the Jehovah Witnesses I know is black. You know, I ain't never seen one. I was like, really? Wow. I mean, I really stood there like, oh, but, they, I, but really? So, I sit up there. I said, okay, okay. So I walked on out. But a, a Hispanic Jehovah Witness? Oh, God, I, I, I got to read some more. But anyway, check this out. So after that, I'm walking down the street. <laughs> and then all of a sudden, I came across this black lady. And then I said, she was in her car. She, I said, hey, ma'am, this is, uh, you know, I'm Patricia Willis, and you know I'm running for you know environmental representative, and I gave her a brochure, and you know hey, this is who I am, and this is what I bought, this is what I stand for, and I hope you vote for me because the upcoming election in May. This whole, I mean, I'm trying not to cuss because somebody gonna tell my mama. Damn. But anyway, she gets this envelope. I mean, I didn't did it for you. I didn't put the uh the mail where you mail it to right here. I didn't gave you. You know, if you and me had no computer, I didn't even print it out the application. Now, all you have to do is just sign right here and sign your name. That's it. Address and who you are. That's it. Nothing else. You don't know what this whole thing Boy, I tell you, black people. I tell you. I love me some black people because I'm one of myself, but damn. Anyway, she said, what is this? What is 
in the hell is this? I said, you know, a little shitty smile. Uh, I said, well, it's just my, um, it's, it, 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 it's my application because I want you to vote for me in the May election for the city of Watts come this May. This is who I am. This is, she said, it don't have no stamp on it. I got to pay for you a stamp? I got to pay? You didn't put no stamp. Oh, she took me there. You didn't give me no stamp? I'm like, oops. 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 And they said, oh. She said, I see what I do. I, I see what I do. So she just bought a six pack of beer and some Hennessy and some come and catch it. And she gonna ask me how much of a stamp. I said, okay. Thank you. So I walked on like, damn. Not worth a stamp, but anyway, anyway, okay, 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 I get it, I get it, I get it, okay. So after that, I walk on by, you know, I feel like mm -hmm. walking on by 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30, and then so all of a sudden, I came across this Hispanic family, you know, they were sitting out, you know, outside, you know, just chilling, you know, like that. I said, and then they had the little, you know, little chichi wawa, little dog. In the yard, you know, barking at me. I said, Hola, Hola, Hola. So, mind you now, my Spanish is not the best, but I figured this. I figured it out. I figured out the language. So, as long as you put O on the back of everything you're saying, then you get to go. They can understand. Okay, so this is what I did. I said, hola. They said, hola. Hola. And then I, I said, okay. My name is Patty. 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 They said, hola, Patty. Patty. And was it a Patty? Patty. Dog still bugging. A little bastard. But anyway, I said, I have a, in this uh, envelope hole. Is a application O. I need you to vote O for O me O. And I said, because in May O is the election O for O what so? I said, shit, ain't good. Am I getting through with these people or what? You know, I, I don't know. But anyway, I said, I also, I said, I a little bendejo. He said, oh. And then I heard the gate open. Yeah. They didn't let that damn dog out. Boy, I tell you, I must have hauled ass all up and down Compton Avenue. I made brochures, applications. They went flying everywhere. So you, basically, you don't have to give me one good business. You just go between 103rd and 108th. You'll see the damn brochures and applications everywhere because I dropped them all. Damn, I took off running. Shit, that little dog was quick. Trying to bite at my ankle. I'm like, oh, 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 oh. And it had a dress on too. Oh, 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 oh. Then I just stopped. And he stopped too. Go, oh, 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 oh. I said, Do you know who I am? Do you know who I am? I am Patty. I am Patty. Do you know who I am, them dog? Oh, 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 oh. I don't give a damn. I don't give a damn who you are. I'm finna bite your ass. I'm finna bite your ass. I don't give a damn. And then all of a sudden, I looked around, looked around, and I kicked the hell out of power. Then I took off running again. Then I landed up in a damn uh, uh, laundry house. Mm. I tell you, shit, this just wasn't my day today. That yesterday wasn't my day, so I had to bring my ass home, and it was cold too. Shit, boy, I had arthritis all this morning. I couldn't even move, but anyway, ooh, Jesus. Boy, it's hard out here for a pimp. I tell you. But anyway, that's said and done. I'm just going to meet y'all over on 139th and Wilmington. At 10 o'clock in the morning, 
Uh, I'll be there with along with United Helping Hands. You'll see the yellow shirt. Uh, they're giving out free food, a box of good food. Their food comes from Whole, Whole Foods and Amazon. They get all their fresh vegetables. They get all their fresh, um, uh, you know, fruit, all that stuff. And they give it away free. And they give tons and tons of fresh meat. They give a lot of Genio products away. So shout out to Helping Hands and Martha. You know, so I'll see you there tomorrow morning. Uh, be there at 10 o'clock, 10 a.m. And um, get your application, your application along with the brochure. So all you have to do is just fill it out. And if you're not a resident of Watts, you can use 1801 East 108th Street, Los Angeles, California, 90059. Address as a place of business that you do. Uh, everybody's on the same page. Just use that it's, uh, when it says uh, uh, stakeholders right there, you say you do business as right here at uh, 1801 East 108th Street. And that's LA, California, 90059. And you can use that address and uh, as you do business as. But your vote will be counted. I will be giving you one of my applications. So I'm just doing this to volunteer and to help Watts be a better Watts. And it's already good good and fabulous of what it is. I've been here over uh, 50 years. And I love my town. I've been through the riots. I've been through the war. So um, I just uh, want to be compelled to sit on the the council board just to see what I can do and how I can help, you know, what's, you know, release the stigma that they have. So, like I said, or you can go online, go online to the little tiny, I think it's tiny.cc forward slash V uh, M B ballots. And you you will vote for me that way. Go online. You don't have to get the uh, the application. You just go on, online. When you go on my Facebook page, you say online votes. Do that, and please. I'm at Regional 9. And I just hope I can be uh, access to the minorities, the Hispanics, the Asians, the, the Afro-Americans here in Watts, a uh, city that I love and born and raised. So... Don't forget to meet me if you want some free food. Uh, to meet me on 139th in Wilmington uh, at 10 o'clock in Compton, right next door to the Pop Posh. And also, my second announcement is that if you're looking for love, uh, DMP will be sponsoring a blind date. Yes, a blind date at the movies. When you come to the movies, you will have your date there. You won't be alone. I will match you up. I will match you up with a partner. Whether however how you swing, just just I'll give you further information. But uh, Madam P is hosting a date night, you know, or date date. You know, it's going to be a nice um, movie, and it comes with popcorn and admission, and it comes with a date, so you won't be alone. So if you're interested in that, holler at me, holler at the girl. And just like I said, uh, just give me a picture and uh, certain things that you require or you want to ask the person on your day, at least five things so I can match you up with that perfect person. Or if you're married or if you're dating, if you would like to be a part, you can come on and join us. You know, it's free popcorn and there is a little uh, lover's fee, you know, so. But it comes with a lot. Who knows? You might find the love of your life. You know, you might find the perfect one for you. So if you're interested in that, just let me know. I'm here. I'm available. You can text me at 310-988-3002. You know, text me a picture and five things you require, you know, in a relationship or five things you would like to ask uh, for starters for your blind date. So, and I will give you further information on how it's going to work and how it's going to set up. We're going to be masked up. We're going to be safe. And um, I hope you find the love of your life or just conversation or just be out with um, uh, a special someone. See, the, but hold up, hold up. I am not responsible. I am not responsible for if you're already in a relationship. 
I am not responsible if you're already married. I am not responsible if you don't work out. So, but there are rules, you know, and we all will be safe. Oh, there go that word. Safe. So, hell, we'll be safe. We'll be masked up. You have popcorn. You have a, um, a nice movie that I picked out. It's called Together Together. It's a nice romantic comedy. And, um, you know, if you want to be on this blind date, just let me know and I will hook you up up you know but you have to like i said there is rules that adds with everything so but good rules good rules don't even trip don't even trip they're safe it's going to be safe it's going to be cute it's going to be fun it's going to be monitored it's, everybody's going to be totally safe you know in all kinds of ways you know so but if you like to be a part of dmp's uh blind date date night that you will have a date at the movies, guaranteed, guaranteed. So, because I only can have so many, I only can have X amount of women, and I can have X amount of men, but you all will be paired, and you'll be matched up, and you will enjoy a nice movie. So, but if you want to be a part of that, just please let me know and holler at the girl, holler at your girl. You can text me, like I said, at 310-988-3002. And let me know if you're in and if you're available. Okay, so again, i see you tomorrow morning on 139th in Wilmington. Um, get your free basket of big old box of food. And uh, you get your application so you can vote for me as Watts Neighborhood Council and your environmental representative. And yes, it!